In this tutorial, we're going to look at how to create a form using the form wizard. We're also going to make this an editable form for the end user. From the forms drop down menu in Acrobat 9 or Acrobat 10, you will select Start Form Wizard. Select Next, clicking Next, and what the wizard will do is it will find areas that were created in, for example, Word, which I created this document to begin with and then made it into a PDF. Now, I can also add a form field, checkbox, and the other features that are available for me. I'm going to choose text field and select into this area here and create a text area. I'm going to add another text area. And if we wish to change the field name, we can change this to a name that would be more appropriate. We can also make this a required field if necessary. Once I have created my necessary form fields, I will then close the form editing. Select the advanced drop down menu and select extended features in Adobe Reader. This is important if you want the end user to be able to fill out the form, save the form, and send it back to you. Many people on the internet don't allow their forms to be created or edited using Adobe Reader, which then creates the end user to have to print the form and then mail it in. If you want your end user to create an electronic form that they can send back to you, you will need to follow this step. Click Save Now. And it will allow you to save this in a file name. We're going to make this one Form A1. We're going to click Save. And now what we're going to do is check this in Adobe Reader. We have now opened the document in Adobe Reader. We're going to fill out the form. And just typing in a couple areas here. and we're going to save this document. I'm going to close this document and reopen the document again and you will see that we have saved the document with the form fields we've created. This will allow your end user to now email the PDF form back to you with the necessary information filled in.